Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And somebody sent me this photograph and it's real sharp, real clean, real good. And I reduce it in size and it's, uh, we go to bitmap. You need to have something checked. Bitmap, resample, you can see it's large. It's 857 dots per inch. And I'm not gonna trace it, but I went to trace, outline trace and high quality image, which I never do. And it came out with this. And I've removed all the background with the exception of this little part. And I thought I'd save it for the video. So just take and just, you know, if you go around with the zoom tool and get pretty zoomed in and re reduce, I mean, take away the stuff that's closest to the shirt and the hands and the hair and the faces. And then you could, then you could start taking out bigger chunks at a time uh, just by selecting a bunch, as long as you don't get a part of the shirt. Anyway, just make sure you got everything gone. Now, I'm not going to do it because uh, my old laptop and it just takes forever. I would select this and hit the boundary tool. So I've already done it up here. And then you could make it black. Whoop, you need to click on that. And then just because we've nudged, I can nudge it right back. And then we're going to take both these and go to the intersect tool. And that's what you get. It took off all the background, everything. Now her hair is a little bit, but you're, he, they're great engraving this on a piece of uh, granite or uh, slate. And we'll always do the yellow box trick just to make sure it worked, order back a page. And you can see there's no background whatsoever. So it's gonna engrave a lot better than, because if you engrave this part, it might really work, but it's, you know, the laser's got to touch it. So it's going to be gray and this isn't going to stand out. So I really, at first I turned it in, I took that item uh, and I, well, let's see if this is it. I can bind it and it came out like this and it did pretty good, but then you hit the boundary tool and if you fill it in with black, you get, well, let's just look at the difference. I think I've got maybe one done. Um, well, can't really break it apart. But this is the boundary tool with the field of black. This is the combine and even made black. So it's got all these lines and fixtures, even though they're not gonna show up in the engraving, you'd be a lot better by doing the boundary tool and then do the intersect tool and what the intersect tool is doing is taking the two pictures and intersecting them together and you get what's left over, what's left in the middle. So that's a sharp picture with pretty good background removal. Hope that helped. Thank you for watching.